in February, I believe. Yeah, February 10th, two days before my birthday. Fountain, yes. Thank you. Oh. Hey, I've seen Freeman get a couple bottles of water. That military post or whatever that that recruiting center. Good luck. Really? I walked in. I got spider webs all over me. I walked into a damn spider web. Ah, here we go. These are. I'm glad to be out of the sun. No, we are in the foyer, the Westerville Police Department. On the door, it said, walk in. So we did. So we did. And then I praised him for having a water fountain, and then it don't work. Well, it so. was, but I would put my mouth on it. Um... I wonder if they know that these are illegal displaying display, dis, displaying of the flag. I think this is a good good idea with the return bins for old strips. Just completely eliminates the uh, possibility of kids getting a hold of them. Yeah. With the opioid epidemic going around here with prescription of drugs, it's kind of a match made in hell if you ask me. Ah, they're open records. Oh, nice. Thank you. I think this is, let's see, looking for a date. April 14th, Law Officer of the Year. Apparently. Those are the good guys. I, I imagine I don't know whose opinion that is. Um, does that mean does that mean that they wrote more tickets than anybody else, or does that mean that they upheld the law better than anybody else? But if you notice the gang emblem in the middle, the gang emblem at the top, the gang emblem all around, all around it, down here with all their badges. All these placards, all these badges that are on the placards, every dis display of the American flag. Is it at least cooler in here? Oh, oh God bless you, honey. Oh, here we go. Hey, gangs of old. If you'd like to be. We're not here to specifically take <laughs> you. Just yeah. placards and awards and things like that. <laughs> Gang symbols. Another, another display of the gang emblem. Uh, I'm an I'm an independent uh, news uh, journalist. Oh, so you're not together? Um, I mean, together, together. I mean, <laughs> what are you, <laughs> I mean, what are you talking here? <laughs> nah, I'm not going that far. I mean, he's cute and all, but <laughs> I don't want too much information. I don't. Have that. <laughs> no, no. We're just no. having some B-roll for a for a story that we're working on. That's all. Okay. 
Let's see what's happening. Maybe they have it all decorated up. Yeah, for out for Memorial, Memorial Weekend and everything. That's beautiful out there. Yeah. yeah. They did a lot with the downtown area. Yeah. Yeah. Community really came together when we lost our, our guys. Yeah. Yeah, I live in the area as well. And uh, yeah, that was, it, it's always bad when, you know, a couple of, couple of officers just get mowed down in the line of duty. Um, yeah, it, it sounded like an ambush to me, to be honest. It sounds like he made the call. And That's what I'm hearing. Mm -hmm. there's, there's is definitely a dangerous job, and for the good cops, I really feel for them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For the bad cops, don't care. They get what they deserve. They're bad cops. They're up here to uphold the law, That's not break it. And I tell you, I've had many cops pull me to the side of the road and demand things from me that they're not allowed to demand, and I just I don't put up with it anymore. Mm -hmm. I just won't. Hey, They're bad cops, and they make the rest of them look bad. Well, the good cops, more power to them. They need to be strong. Absolutely. They need to be real strong. Absolutely. Um, but they, in all fairness, they do an impossible job. <laughs> they get called out to a, to a domestic dispute, and there's two people fighting, and you got to calm them down and figure out what's going on while keeping them calm and making sure everybody says it's, it's an impossible task. She works in human Oh, I didn't know that that's what you were here for. I'm so sorry. I had no idea. I was just using that as a for example. No, 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 I know. But I mean, she wasn't in the house when they called. She was outside in the bushes. What, in the bushes when she was just not there? Mm -hmm. I think we used the right word, ambush. It's a sad, sad thing that, that, that um, things happen like that. I mean, it's the world we live in today. Yeah. But, you know, but you know, people like us walking around with these. You never know, we might catch something. Right. Might, you know, that the cops didn't get because cause cops don't prevent crime. They react to it. Right. So, I mean, because if someone kicks in your door, comes in, does whatever they're going to do, and then they leave, oh, you call the cops, they're there 10 minutes later. Them. They're not preventing. They're, they're not preventing. They're reacting to it. And that's all they really can do. It's unbelievable. So, what they, what get they back in here real quick. Mm -hmm. There's so many people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In case you ever need to come here, you can. Stuff like this because we do a lot of interaction with law enforcement, and it's, I would say, what, 99% of the time, it's just, hi, how are you, what you doing today, no big deal, and, uh, and, and they'll hold their oath to the Constitution, and that's, that's, all, that's all we ask for. You live around here? I do. Yeah, don't kid. I live a little further east, but yeah. You should take the, um, the police academy class. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it's free. Oh. It's free for 13 weeks. Really? <laughs> I took it. My son took it um, last year. So is that? It's the one wants to go down or under the police. Um, thing. It, it is wonderful. I mean, you're not doing push-ups or anything like that. Right. Oh, good. I haven't done those for 20 oh, years. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm worried about that. So what, they run you through the courses and let you know how it's all done and... They talk about the legal stuff, they show you how they, that search, actually, how they yeah. search things, how, and they give you some situations at the end where you actually get to... Uh, well, you know what? Maybe we could uh, cool. Maybe we could do that. Hey, maybe this guy knows something. Oh, I'm sorry. Were you here for her? Yeah. I'm so sorry. Yeah, we'll let you be. I just, we were chatting with her. And <laughs> Have a good day, sir. I'm, I'm recruiting you <laughs> Yeah, I was going to, was going to ask you if you knew anything about the classes over there and what days and when you can I sign up. What, what I would do is I would call the um, uh, 901-6450, which is our records. Okay. They'll be in right now, okay. but I would ask for community services. Thank you. Sounds good, sir. Yep, you guys Have a good one. Did she say her, her daughter was involved in the shooting? No, no. Oh. She was here. I, it was a weird... I thought I heard her say... I thought I heard her say, well, my daughter was part of that shooting. And I was like, oh, my God, did we just put a mouth disease? <laughs> but, yeah, um, uneventful, guys. <sighs> Damn it. I, I mean, yay, uneventful. So, that was 21 Police Plaza. I'm sorry, 21 City Hall, rather. Beautiful city of Westerville, Ohio. Memorial Day 2018. 
That's a traffic sign. I'm not traffic. I'm pedestrian. Yeah, I saw that when I was coming down the street. I haven't seen a thin blue line on the cruisers yet. Yeah, I must admit they are. I think this is their little little sally port or whatever. Take you in there before they take you out of the cruiser, that way you can't run. Apparently, the lady inside that we were speaking with, a very nice old lady, um, said they give free classes on how to be a cop. Um, she said it wasn't all the physical and all the endurance and all that, but they, they teach you all the stuff, the classroom stuff, and how to search and what to look for and, you know, how to, I guess, how to perceive deception and things like that. I uh, think I might come up and sit through a few of the classes and record it and see if they, re they uh, uh, respect our right to record. And uh, maybe throw a few good questions at them in the classroom. Try to get that on video. Okay. Thin blue line. Thin blue line. Thin, boy, this guy's really proud of his gang. Look at that. Golf Alpha Zulu 8955. Gang member. I wonder if this guy's a gang member too. Yep. Yep, look, there it is. Thin blue line. There and there. Golf Xerox Washington 7299. So, not on the cruisers, but boy, they sure sport it on their personal vehicles. You can't take my picture. Now, see, I apologize for recommending this place. They support the gang members. They've got the uh, the gang colors flying in the window. I wonder if 
What if I walked in there with the wrong gang signs on if they attack me or something? This must be the, the local hangout. Well, we're back to the old elementary school. I think uh, another uneventful audit. I guess that's really, in all actuality, what we are looking for. This is Buckeye in the Sky News, Westerville, Ohio, Memorial Day. Uh, hope everybody enjoyed their Memorial Day. Time to go back to work tomorrow. So, Buckeye in the Sky News, signing off.